in 65 days now that mothers are still they are crying they are in sorrow it's not just 100 girls this is 273 girls that are kidnapped innocent girls girls from home girls that have parents girls that are just struggling to come out of vicious cycle of poverty and illiteracy girls that are from a background that is dejected that is marginalized that is not even just nothing no facility no care just put yourself in the shoe of those mothers supposing it is your daughter that is missing for 65 days how will you feel emotionally physically and otherwise it is terrible. It's a terrible situation. They don't know whether these girls are alive or not. They don't know whether these girls are sick or not. We don't know whether these girls they eat or not. We don't know whether these girls are being raped or not. These mothers are traumatized. Many of them, they develop high blood pressure. Many of them, they are just confused. Many of them, they don't even know what to do. They can't eat. They are living in fear. They are living in just agony. And that's why we are telling them there is hope. And we are wearing yellow. And we are appealing to every Nigerian to hear, to, to wear this, that there is hope. That we are hoping that our daughters will come back. We are hoping that one day we shall receive back our girls. And then we want every woman to come on the 28th of June so that we can cry out unto God. It is only him that will help us at Tafa Balewa Square by 10 a.m. so that we can cry out unto God. He that never fails. He that hears our prayers. He who knows the location of these girls and he who has power to bring back our girls. God bless you.